hasidic teenager was indicted today on attempted murder charges for the fiery religious dispute in the ultra-orthodox village of New Square. News 12 Sherry Bottino has more on the case of Shaul Spitzer. He did not intend to cause physical injury to anybody. Attorney Ken Gribitz is speaking about his client, 18-year-old Shaul Spitzer, who's accused of setting Aaron Rottenberg on fire. The attack happened on May 22nd outside Rottenberg's New Square home when Spitzer allegedly confronted Rottenberg with a firebomb. Aaron Rottenberg, a father of four, suffered extensive second and third degree burns to his upper body and arms. He prays for Mr. Rottenberg on a daily basis. He's cried endlessly uh, for what has transpired. He's completely contrite, and he wished he could just turn the calendar back and turn the clock back, and this incident never took place. Aaron Rottenberg spoke exclusively to News 12 on Wednesday about the attack. He says it happened because he didn't worship at New Square's main synagogue, which angered Hasidic Grand Rabbi David Tversky. I don't know if he said burn down the house, but it's definitely that he wanted that I shouldn't continue going and that I should move out of there. And they did whatever they felt like doing in order to enforce what he wants them to enforce. The Rottenberg family has filed an $18 million lawsuit, but the district attorney says so far there is no evidence the grand rabbi ordered Spitzer to carry out the attack. Mr. Spitzer was in no way influenced by the grand rabbi. The grand rabbi had nothing to do with this case. He was, had no knowledge of what was, of, of this, that this was going to take place in any manner, shape, or form. In New Square, Sherry Bettino, News 12. Shaul Spitzer, that suspect, is out on bail. He will be arraigned Friday morning in court. If convicted, he faces up to 25 years in prison.